Well, today in this video we are going to model and simulation two-phase flow and uh, the movement of uh, oil drops in the water. The results that we want to uh, extract are a wide fraction of uh, water or, or oil uh, as animations uh, and velocity profile. Uh, we have two different uh, equations. First, linear uh, 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 equation uh, for water section and oil parts. Uh, and uh, we should solve another equation that uh, measures uh, interface between two phases uh, by time. So, we switch in console model 6 window, click on model wizard. 2D dimension and in fluid flow section we select multi phase flow and in two phase flow level set we select laminar two phase flow level set added in our models bar and we select time dependent with uh, phase initialization. Click on done. At the first step, we select centimeter as the length unit and rectangle with three centimeter width and five centimeter height. Two centimeter. Okay. It is our main channel. We have a oil part on top of our channel so we add another rectangle here and we have three circles they assume to be drops oil drops okay so we select uh, union to make them unique and select all of them. So it is our geometry. We select water and oil and liquids section, oil and water. In laminar flow part, we active gravity because we don't see force cause drop or drops moving uh, up and we right click on laminar flow and points we select pressure point constraint at this part in level set section we right click and we select initial interface we select drops surface and this part and in initial value we should select uh, what exactly uh, what fl what fluid uh, are exists uh, in that part so click on this part and select water as a first fluid and oil as a second in initial value one we select water parts so as you see we can change it because it is console default so we click on second initial value and select oil parts it change so we click on mesh and five or three second for running click on compute before that we can activate uh, results while solving and we can track uh, our results uh, while 
uh, the console is solving. So click on compute. After running, uh, we have uh, velocity profile, pressure, and volume fraction of uh, fluid uh, by time. If, if you select any time that you want, you can track drops movement. I click on results tab, and by selecting player, uh, we can choose for example, void fraction of fluid, and we can have an animation in this part. Good luck.